Everyone believes that combos are gone from Fortnite, but I think they're wrong. There's a big secret on the island that everyone's missing. And the question isn't, are combos alive? But instead, which team are combos on? The imagined order or the seven? We're going to be finding out. Scattered around the new island, we can see debris, divots, and destruction in very specific areas of the map, which have come from the imagined order, taking over so much of the island. Cars destroyed, trees crushed, even buildings completely taken over by the IO. If we look at these specific locations all over the map, we can see that they happen over areas in which the imagined order and the seven are battling for control. But more importantly, these areas line up almost identically with the combo spawn areas back from the previous season. The imagined order and the seven have been fighting over the combos and they have not gone. They've been taken by one of the teams. But if someone has gained control of Clombo, who is it and why is he currently not being found on the island? To understand it better, we need to think about Clombo himself. Clombo was a friendly fella that if you went up to, would smile at you, give you free loot and even launch you around the map. Of course, shooting him would not lead to a very good time. But let's not forget, Clombo was indestructible. No one ever managed to take down and eliminate Clombo. So there's no way that he's gone from the island, the creature's literally unkillable. To further back up the fact that I don't believe that Clombo is gone, Fortnite very clearly said that if anything happened to Clombo, they would destroy Tilted Towers. And yes, there may be a massive imagined order blimp above Tilted, but it is standing pretty strong right now. Tilted Towers is here, which means Clombo's must be here on the island. If Clombo had free reign and choice as to which team he would join, do you think he'd join the evil imagined order, or do you think I think you'd go ahead and join the seven. I'd like to think that Clombo would want to be on the seven side and you'd probably see him on the island right now helping us out, trying to take down these evil no-gooders called the Imagined Order, but, but they're not on the island, which means one thing. In the Imagined Order's giant fight that happened between the end of last season and the start of this season and all of the battle locations that have caused all of these marks on the island where Clombo's used to spawn and with the fact that the Imagined Order hold most of the iron control right now. I hate to say it, but the imagined order, I believe, took control of the Clombos and have gone ahead, hiding them on the island. If Clombos wanted to work for the Seven, but were being taken over by the imagined order and refused to fight for the evil team that's currently taking over the island, then instead of the imagined order being able to use the Clombos on their side, they have had to go ahead and lock away Clombos so no one can use them in the Fortnite battle. If the imagined order were to hide the Clombos, anywhere on the island within the areas that they currently control, it's safe to say that their new and updated Command Cavern that has seen a huge upgrade since the start of this season would be the location that Clombos would be stored. This place is literally the head of all communications for the Imagined Order. A giant satellite, the biggest blimp of them all. The ability to scan and fill this area with loot means that definitely Clombo is hidden somewhere in this area. On the blimp, you can, of course, find many imagined order henchmen and even a boss. Oh, here he is himself, who I don't want to mess with and will not lead us to any answers for Clombo. He just wants to take you down. Instead, we need to go deep within their cavern to find their big secret, as I believe I found exactly where Clombo currently is. Now, whilst their previous imagined order guard is looking after the blimp. This guy right here is also guarding something incredibly important. I actually do need to take him down as he's going to be a huge issue for me getting to where I want to get to to help try and save Clombo. Luckily, this guy's no match for the brand new burst assault rifle and the coast is now clear. Inside this huge imagined order layer, there's a brand new hole. A new vault leading deeper within the imagined order base that is currently vaulted, locked and closed off with absolutely no way of entering at the moment. Did you hear that? 
Did you hear that noise? There is something deep within this giant vaulted door. Clearly marked with the Imagined Order logo, guarded by one of their strongest henchmen. They do not want anyone to find out what's behind this door. That means if Clombo is behind here, we may never see Clombo again if the Imagined Order don't ever release him out onto the island. If you're watching right now and you want Clombo to return to the island, hit that thumbs up button. I'm so interested to see how many likes we get on this video. But no matter how badly we want him to return, the Imagined Order won't let it happen, but there's some good news. Now, hopefully, like me, you are on Team 7, and you want the 7 to be the guys that come out of this huge battle as the ultimate winners. Well, the good news is, throughout this season, we'll continue to see the areas owned by the Imagined Order and the 7 constantly change, with the Imagined Order's blue areas getting bigger and bigger and it will have a huge impact on the island. Thanks to the in-game files, we know that as the Seven take back more of the island, many things will start to happen, including the destruction of the blimps. These things will turn into crash sites and will literally be taken down and unusable by the Imagined Order. All of the tank locations are currently around the blimp locations as well. And as the blimps get taken down and turned into huge crash sites, the tanks will also be completely reskinned and taken over by by the seven to now become their tanks. That's not all. Helicopters will soon be fundable this season, just like we've had the armor battle bus be your fundable station at the beginning of the season. And when helicopters return, they won't be the usual orange helicopters that we're used to. Oh no. These helicopters, just like the tanks, will be reskinned specifically to show the seven's colors on them, meaning that the sevens are taking this battle seriously and are bringing all the power they possibly possibly can to take down the imagined order. I know what you're thinking. What have tanks and what have helicopters got to do with Clombo and the giant cavern that is so clearly owned by the imagined order? How are the seven going to take this back? Well, I'm not saying that any of this is going to happen quickly, that's for sure. This will be an ongoing battle throughout the season as we constantly see the Imagined Order and the IO go back and forth. But ultimately, the Seven will want to get rid of the Imagined Order completely and the end goal will, of course, be to take over the Cavern, Imagined Order's core base right here on the island. We know how valuable this location is. It is so well locked down. It even has their own underground vault filled with loot. It will be so incredible for the Seven to take it, but more importantly, for them to potentially release the Clombos, have them on their team and bring them back to the Fortnite Island. If the Seven are successful in this huge battle, which may not have a conclusion until the end of this season, we did not get a live event at the end of last season, which typically means the next season will have something absolutely huge. We are building up to what could be one of of the hugest battles and live event in Fortnite history, which we're all hoping ends up with the seven, the team that are supporting us, the loopers, the players trapped on the Fortnite island forever and ever, winning and taking down the imagined order, thus meaning taking control of this cavern, the tanks, the helicopters, everything on the island, allowing us access to unlock the huge locked door of this vault, freeing Clombos back into the world of Fortnite so finally they can return to the island, become our friends and be set free as we all want them to come back to Fortnite. But if they fail, if the Imagined Order win the battle, things will be bad. We will most definitely never see Clombos back on the Fortnite island. We will probably then see the destruction of Tilted Towers yet again. With no Clombos means no Tilted Towers. One of our favorite locations and favorite creatures in the Fortnite island destroyed together, all because of the imagined order and their evil plans. We will not know the answer of this huge feud until the end of this season and you already know that whatever goes down, it will be live streamed here on my channel so make sure you're subscribed. The results of this battle are going to be huge and I am definitely on the team of the seven. I'm so interested to know your thoughts and what I've shared in the comment section 
And if you want to see what a dead Clombo, I know it's a sad thought, click on screen to see a skeleton of a Clombo on a Fortnite map that you can jump into and experience yourself. Also, my brand new Allie tracksuit, new hoodie and tracksuit trousers are available right now at Allie.shop. They are live. You guys are absolutely loving them. A link to that will be in the description, so don't miss out as well. I truly hope we see the return of Clombos to the Fortnite Island soon. It'll all be determined this season. It's going to be crazy.